Hello, I'm Jane Bishop, and your word for the day is weeding. I'm in my backyard today, yes, in the hot sun, but sweat equity can be very therapeutic. Weeding out the unwanted grass and weeds that have developed largely because of a development that has occurred behind me where it used to be woods. They demolished the woods over a year ago and now are preparing for a subdivision. Anyway, back to our word for the day, weeding. Think about that in life. What is it that you have ignored for too long and has begun to take over and has perhaps sucked out your energy, your joy, your attitude of finding ways to continue to live forward in life? That's what happens with weeds. If we ignore them, don't pull them up, or don't treat them, they're going to continue to multiply. And once they multiply, it becomes much more difficult to remove them. So weeding in our life often requires us to do a personal assessment or a personal audit and thinking about what have I ignored? What do I believe if I just simply ignore it, it will go away? I invite you to ponder today what is that item or items in your life and maybe do a weeding audit of your life, either personally, professionally, or both. Because I assure you that if you ignore it, it will not go away. Now, the result is great satisfaction as I complete the weeding process in my yard, then it becomes clean and inviting and enjoyable again. And how wonderful it is when we can take steps on a daily basis to keep the weeds from multiplying in our life so that we can be the best we can be. If you want a Jane Storming session, it's free to get started with your weeding audit. Text your name and Jane Storming to 404-432-2701. Enjoy weeding out unnecessary or unhealthy things in your life. One pull at a time. Have a great day, a great afternoon, or a great evening, wherever this finds you.